Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Collecting and paying sales tax can be complicated for some companies. For example, a company may have to collect and pay more than one sales tax. Many companies have a mix of taxable and non-taxable products and services to sell, and many also have some customers that are taxable while other customers are not. In QuickBooks, you can apply sales tax on selected items for taxable customers during the sales process. It also keeps track of how much sales tax is collected and for which taxing agencies the sales tax is collected. From this information, QuickBooks can then create the check or checks for the appropriate tax agency or agencies when the sales taxes collected are due. However, to use QuickBooks to track and pay sales tax, you must perform the steps that we will now cover. We will examine each part of this process in detail later to assist you in setting up your company to track and pay sales tax. So first you need to set up sales tax agencies, sales tax items, and sales tax groups. In the vendors list, you create the tax agencies to whom you submit the sales taxes that are collected. Then, in the item list, you create the separate tax rates you need to charge for each sales tax collected as sales tax items. If needed, you can also create sales tax groups that assess a set of sales taxes on sales in each district for which you collect and report sales tax. After that is finished, you then indicate taxable and non-taxable customers and items. So in both your customer job and your items list, you indicate which items and customers are taxable or non-taxable. You then apply tax to taxable sales. So when you create an invoice or sales receipt that includes taxable items for a taxable customer, QuickBooks calculates, collects, and tracks the sales tax automatically. You then find out what you owe. So as taxable sales are recorded, QuickBooks keeps track of the sales tax collected in the sales tax payable account within the chart of accounts. When it comes time to pay a sales tax agency, you can open the sales tax payable register to see how much is owed, or you can create a sales tax liability report. You then simply pay your tax agencies. So within the Pay Sales Tax window, QuickBooks shows the amount of sales tax owed and creates the check or checks to the tax agency or agencies for the amount or amounts that are collected. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.